Hello everybody, welcome back to RimWorld. We left off last episode realizing that we were out of pastille. So what we are going to have to do is start uh, hitting up a lot of these hot spots with our miners. I don't know if we have any, I think we might have one in here, here we go. Uh, start hitting up these hot spots with our miners and seeing if we can't figure out where we can find some plasteel. Like, uh, why don't we try, uh, see, I feel like plasteel would be an average, would be like an average sized one. Like me, that one's pretty big. Maybe down here. And then we would need power down there too. God, every time, it seems the, as, as the, we get getting further and further into the game, it kind of like gets those little lag spikes there when things are happening. It freaks me out every time. Uh, titanium plate armor, good. That's it? I mean, it's worth a lot. Okay. That is worth about a few. Uh, and we could also keep exploratory mining, too, to see if we can find any. I think what I would do, though, is do it this way. <laughs> Like so. That's titanium right there. So if I ever need more of that, I know it's it's easy to get to. Oh, it's, I was like, whoa! And then it starts going into the deeper area there, that's why. We'll just do a little stop there for now. A little bit more exploratory mining. Uh, Plasteel! Ah! Good call. Um, I'd like to hit... You know what? Let's, let's do this, too. So let's uh, go all the way to the edge here. Because that'll get me access to that one. I'm thinking maybe that one could be Plasteel, too. It's a good call on that. This is a little dangerous, but there are I mean, if anybody busts through here then tries to get into my base, they're getting them they're putting themselves in a choke point and I can hit with you know, a small but oh. Small but efficient colony, I can handle choke points. You know what we should just do? Just take it all out. We don't need any of that in there. Just get rid of all of it. Now anybody who runs this thing will get me get me that plus steel I need. But they have actual mining. Whoa, this is a huge area. How did I never I didn't even notice how big that one was? Do we have any more thingies around? I don't think I have any more. I think what we'll do is probably build a couple more. They're in here, aren't they? Oh, I don't actually see it in here. Under production? Ah, it is. Let's do this. Hit a couple of those other ones as well. I mean, they'll probably end up going through, like, a lot of the actual mining before they go to the, the deep drills, but that's okay. Remember, animals, if you ever get hungry... Yeah, who's a good bear? Who's a good grizzly bear number two? Who's a good grizzly bear? I was about to say, if you ever get hungry, don't forget that the corpse hole is always full. Oh, got uranium slugged and half eaten. Oh. Where? It's not. Oh, it's right over here. Nice little uh, boon there. Oh, there's some here too. Exploratory mining falls the wind. 
Didn't find what we need, but I'll take it. Seven to five, you are slow. Oh god, that's mining 12. I think, I think it's gonna be a shock for me when I get, start a new colony and I don't have, you know, super skilled bionic people with speed suits on. I think I'm gonna be in for a shock. Yeah, because look at four or five. He has, well, he has a lot of bionics. He's got about a few of them. I love my 2B array. These guys are great. Yes. Yes! Provide me with power. I wonder if they age while they're in there. Could they, I don't know, I don't think so. Doesn't seem like they decay. Yeah, because like this guy that I put, the last guy that I put in there had was almost bled out when we threw him in there and he's still good. He's still just fine. Did they do any of these ones up here? Oh yeah, they did. Didn't find a damn thing though. Never mind, they did. I like how when, when I was desperate for components, I was mining out these massive areas and can never find anything. And now I found like three or four deposits of components without even trying. They're just, they're just in the way. Now we do have more of these we can install if we want to. It's still loaded. Oh. Traits bloodlust, fast learner, incapable of dumb labor, crafting, and cooking. Sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and pass on that. I don't need you. And that is a lot of people. It's a lot of corpses. Ugh. Oh, I wonder how they feel when they go in there. Oh, I like how the bear joined the party. He was probably under the table, like, trying to get some cake. I feel like I, uh, I feel like we should be telling everybody to wear... ...better armor these days. Well, because at this point, the marine armor would be, is going to be better than just wearing, like, the flak jackets and whatnot. I think we need more, I think we need more plasteel. Oh, yeah, you know why? We've been ripping through advanced components. What's the, um, armor take? 100 plasteel each. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. We're flying through it. There we go. What's that? Hey, gold! A oh, fair bit of it, too. And more freaking components! That's a fair bit of gold. 300? Oh, it's a race! Four or five's winning! And it's over. Look, <laughs> he started this one. Dink. Pandemonium. Nice name. Nice name. Love it. So, our, it looks like we are... I think I just saw some guy eat. No, I thought I saw somebody hauling some plasteel, but no. Alright, how much time do we got? I haven't been paying attention to this. Because we want to do this one. 19 enemies. We got 9 days. That's plenty. Hyperweave and the tech prof sub. You know what? Why don't we fucking Google that? Because I don't know what that is, and and I may I've made mistakes in the past. So RimWorld tech prof sub persona core. Oh, well, that's <laughs> instantly completes a research project. That would have been super useful, like way earlier. Oh well. Not as interesting as I thought it was going to be. I kind of like our tomb. Self-tamed muffalo, nice. How much is, uh, is, if I wanted to make a statue out of, say, solid gold? Hmm. 
think it requires a thousand. I can make it out of silver. I got enough of that. Oh. Making uranium sculpture. I was thinking about something for the crypt. To keep uh, Tano 5. You know, keep him company in there. Make sure he's happy with his lot in life. I'm kind of sad that we ran... That, I didn't even... I, I'm sure someone in the comment section will, will have been watching the stores, like, slowly dwindle down to nothing, going, Aah! I did not notice. And there are... I do have access to more, um... Things like this. So... I haven't bothered to use this yet, but we can. I think I think it'd be under here somewhere. Let's see. Heaters, boilers, toilets, thermostat, water treatment, sewage treatment. Let's see if there's a hot tub, radiators. Litter box, kitchen sink, washing machine. Oh, it's right there. Let's put one of those there. Put one of those there. Sprinklers actually do take up. They're not like on the ceiling. They do take up space. All right, so that's got to be connected. Let's see. How do we connect them? Air conditioning pipe. All right, we got to get it over there uh, neatly. Eh, eh, there we go. I haven't used this yet. Should work just fine. Uh, we'll want the temperature to be like, yeah, that's fine. It doesn't go any lower than that. I guess that's the uh, the max, the, the, as far low as it'll go. That's it. And this should be plenty to uh, keep that, because I don't need any, I don't need to do any more cooling anywhere. It's the only place that needs to remain cool. That allowed me to get rid of this. And that. Oh, and somebody asked oh, uh, why this vent in here. Uh, is there it's emergencies that little black line through it means it's it's closed right now So it's just acting as a wall, but I had a situation earlier where I lost power and then my food starting to, started to rot because it was hotter and it was colder outside Than it was inside the cooler So the vents there just in case something like that ever happens again I just open the vent and the cool air from outside will help cool down the food All right, so is this working? Uh, cooling usage, 300. Connected cooling, 100. So I need more of these. Do I need a thermostat in there? Maybe I, uh... Where are thermostats? Is that under here? Thermostat. Put a therm... Does it go on the... What do we want? Let me put this over, over here. That looks weird. Hey, the animal heart's been completed. Alright, so now... Target temperature should be... What? Five?
Doesn't go any lower than five? What the hell? No, I don't want that. That's weird. Just put this thing up to a hundred. So cooling usage 300, connecting cooling 100. So it looks like each of these is 100. So I need a couple of them. Let's see. That was over here. Boop, boop. And after this, I'm going to go have to take my dog for a walk because she's whining. She wants to go outside and play. She's laying right next to, like, under my desk right now, just going, hoo, hoo, hoo. So I'll, I'll do this one, and then I'll take her out for a play date. So now it's cranking. So let's uh, take these out. Work faster for the next eight days. Yes! Yes, faster! We must work faster. I'm not worried about the, the time on, um, on this raid here. Six and a half days. Because we can launch ourselves over there with enough people to murder them. Ooh, two. We can launch ourselves over there, no problem. Something getting worked on there? Unfinished shield belt. Oh, this last one on the, the queue. Alright, what are we working on over here? Steel. I think this one was... Resource below marble. Boring. I don't know why we never finished this one. I think it's just steel, but that's fine. Kind of want to just get it out of the way. Oh, and, uh, you! Get on it, friend. Give her that bionic heart. Not gonna use anything better than- oh, you know what? So I say, go get the good stuff, friend. Zarina uh, deserves it. Just because she's awesome. Nice. Spire recruitment. Efficiency 125%. Armor. So it's armored? Like, like it's, it's maybe it's harder to destroy. It's a hardened heart. I'm pretty sure this is just steel over here. I can't seem to... Oh, it's right here, that's why. No, it's titanium, actually. That's okay. That's just fine. Alright, where's Zarina now? Oh, wow! 400 off of one... Wow, for one growth. Let's give her a uh, front right leg. Yeah, and there's they're doing... Oh, that's loud. I feel like that got picked up on the microphone. There's um, yard work going on outside. I think it might be a good idea to take a uh, a break from the recording to take the dog for a walk. <laughs> let let them let them finish their yard work in in peace. Oh, oh, she doesn't like the noise. You are fucking in the same room with the. Uh... That is really loud. That is really loud. Wait, what? That's with the windows shut too. Jesus Christ. 
Yeah, I know, Penny. I'm bent out of shape about it, too. It's so loud. So much noise. We got all these belts. These all should be good, too. They should be on you. Well, no. Some of them are unused. Some of them are the old ones we took off. Alright, so that one was just boring steel, so. We can try this one. See what's there. There. You know what? This is driving me nuts. I think I'm going to end this episode just a little early today because of that. And we'll pick this up tomorrow. Maybe I'll give you guys a couple extra minutes tomorrow to make up for this. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you next time.